Welcome back to the Southern Snack. For life is too short to be serious. All right, folks, we just got out of the grocery store called Giant, and they had a new uh, sushi flavor. It's a uh, Sichuan Chili Crisp California Roll. Uh, I don't know if there's anything, any like if there's shrimp or anything in there. Uh, oh, imitation crab says it right on the thing. So fake crab. Wow. Don't know why you would be so excited about having fake crab. Um, anyways, they also have a spicy chicken California roll, which was intriguing. I've never had chicken in a California roll before. So I got that too. All right. I'm going to stop staring. It was $9.49, which I guess, I mean, that's the average price for sushi, ain't it? Uh, for a sushi roll. $9.49 for the Sichuan Chili Crisp. Uh, looks like it's got some chilies on there. Of course, you know, why should that be a surprise? Um, this thing could be spicy. So let's see if it's got good flavor. Some moments you know, have that really good, savory, slightly sweet flavor. Others kind of bland at points. It's the white rice, right? It's the white rice that gets a little bit bland. The heat level, not super high. Not not a lot of heat here. Um, it's more like just like some chili flakes here and there. Um, but not like, it lingers a little bit. But it's not like when we went to Panda, Panda Express when they did their chili shrimp that sucked not because of the heat level i think they did good on the spice level but that sucked because it had no flavor it was literally just shrimp with heat and that was it it's like why would you ever want to sell that i don't know this at least has some flavor but it doesn't have a lot of heat it's okay the flavor is good though. i'll give it a six i want more heat more heat and maybe real meat well i guess it's meat but you know what i mean all right so the spicy chicken california roll was 6.49 so a better price but of course you're using probably the cheapest meat on the market chicken book, 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 book. all right um let's see how this spicy chicken california roll is let's see if it's spicy at all None of these spicy sushis are ever spicy. You know that? Did, did you ever notice that? They're never, ever, ever spicy. Anyways, let's try it. The chicken's very tender, so I would assume it's like shredded chicken. There's not a lot to this either, and it's not spicy. Less flavorful too, but you can eat it. You're not gonna repulse to it. You're not gonna be like, oh, I'm upset because it's disgusting. No, you're not gonna be disgusted. You're gonna be more like, where's the flavor? Where's the heat? Because there's not. I give it a five. I mean, it just it's okay. I can sit here and eat the whole roll, and I won't complain. But I'm also gonna be real with you. There's no spice. It never is spicy. Dude, when you read a, 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 a sushi menu and it says spicy, don't ever, don't ever go in and expect spicy. It better say extremely spicy. Because it's not going to be spicy if it says spicy. I'm just warning you. I'm just warning you. So, yeah, I just wasted 16 bucks at Giant on two things. I mean, I'll probably eat this stuff, but, oh, man, I was not impressed was not impressed anyways that is my review i'm sticking to it i'll see y'all around surprise yeah. see you just never know when a review's gonna continue and guess what it's continuing with chili lime mango salmon rolls now this one sounds good this one sounds very 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 good but you know with martin's you never trust or giant or any of those sushi grocery store sushi places you, you can't trust it till you try it so ooh. 
I had the perfect piece of sushi that I wanted to try there and then it falls. So we're gonna just grab the next piece and move on with our life. All right, there she is, there she is, there she is. Let's try the chili lime mango salmon roll. Hmm. I would say it uses, I mean, you know the salmon's not fresh, but I would also say it uses uh, frozen mango, not fresh mango. I shouldn't be surprised, but you know, it's it's not gonna come anywhere close to fresh sushi, right? Fresh sushi's way better than this. Um, It's interesting, right? There's a nice little fruity mango profile. It's a lot of heat, that's still kind of simmering. The little zestiness of the limes there, but that frozen salmon, that not so fresh salmon, really just doesn't stand out. It doesn't. So I wouldn't really recommend these. I do like the blend of flavors. I think those are interesting, um, but I'm gonna give this a six out of 10. So again, I think the most impressive uh, piece of sushi I've had from Martin's or Giant or any of these places, ironically, was the Flamin' Hot Cheetos. Very interesting. Very interesting to say the least. So hopefully this review was insightful and uh, you'll decide whether you want to get this or not. You may not even ever see it, but it was something interesting to throw in.